guys and welcome back to my youtube channel it's your favorite queen queen of modesty coming at your life from lagos nigeria today guys we are going to be doing the easiest makeup technique you have ever seen in your entire life guys okay this is not like no cut crease or like all these like makeup ten up term terminologies it's like the simple the simplest the easiest makeup routine you've ever seen in your entire life okay guys so let's get right into it so the first thing that i do is to obviously you're going to wash your face okay and probably you guys are looking at me like i thought you, you already had like a moisturizer on no i don't i do have very oily skin <laughs> so that's why i'm literally just glistening right now in your face but um regardless of my oily skin i still do put on a little bit of lotion now i use my body lotion i don't i don't really use any prime i don't use this this routine is super easy super cheap nothing fancy at all like because i live i live a very simple lifestyle i don't do too much <laughs> okay the only time i probably do too much is like when i'm doing like photo shoots and stuff then i may do just, just, just a little bit much but um, I'm a very simple person, so this routine starts off with body lotion, okay, like your body cream, your body lotion, what you use on your body, that's what I use as my moisturizer slash primer, and this is the current cream that I'm using for my body, now I use this cream because it's actually just a cream I decided to try, to be honest, I've never used this cream before, but I have been blessed with very, with a very versatile skin you know my skin can actually just like take any different product and it, it's not that thin I'll probably say it's not that sensitive to like different products I can try like different creams on my face and I'll still be my face is still like my skin will still be perfectly fine so I've just been blessed with that kind of skin so I use this now currently this is basically almost finished so it was actually basically finished to be honest so what's inside this you know as a an environment preserver i would like to think <laughs> but um i use the reduce reuse recycle mentality situation and i put my mom's nivea natural fairness cream into this bottle okay instead of throwing it away um I decided to repurpose it and put this. So what's in here is a little bit of this cream that was left in there and then my mom's Nivea Natural Fairness Cream. So this is what I'm going to be using. Everything is literally in Spanish. So anyways, but moisturize. So first of all, we're going to moisturize. Now I use very little because as you can see, I have very oily skin, so I don't put too much. So just two drops of this, like so. One <laughs> and uh, two, perfect. Okay, now that's all I'm going to be using for my face. So I'm just gonna rub together, and then we're just going to moisturize the entire face, so we don't have, so we don't dry out our skin with the translucent powder because it's very drying and. Um, you don't want to be looking all, you know, patchy and like I think the skin is peeling or something. Because literally that's how my face looks if I do not moisturize. Like if I just like the one, you know, like powder on my face and then there's like, you know, um, and I don't moisturize. Like my face looks really, it looks like it's peeling. It looks like, <laughs> it looks really, 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 really funny. So I always try to moisturize. So you're just going to make this like nice and dry. Um, so once this is dry, we move on to the next um, part of this technique slash routine or whatever you want to call it. Now I use a powder puff. And the powder that I'm going to be using, like I told you guys, it's the easiest, it's the cheapest, nothing fancy. This I got from my um local supermarket so it's just from the beauty this is a beauty the the bath and body side of not necessarily bath and body but like 
the bath body beauty hair it's like a section that has like beauty products bath um bath and body products and then it has like other stuff so i picked up this this is the powder i've been using for about yikes for as long as i can remember since i said to be honest since i started using powder i think this is okay no, i used to use one powder called nicele but i'm using this for probably about like maybe like maybe like six to seven years or something like that but this has done this has done it for me so i actually love it it's perfumed it smells really really nice um so it's called enchanteur 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 help me out french people please okay it's called enchanteur um romantic perfumed palette Yeah, that was just a fail but yes guys anyway so i use this now i try not to put too much because i the the whole point of this um routine is to just look matte so that i don't go around looking oily like this so just to look matte and just just a just to look put together not crazy or something like that if you want me so i try not to use as much powder as possible just a few dual lips because as you guys can see this is what the inside it has about one two three six tiny little um outlets so you have to be careful when you're pouring it onto your powder puff so this is just basically all that i'm going to use i don't know if you guys can actually see it but that's what i'm going to be using i'm just going to rub it around the powder puff and i'm probably going to fast forward myself blending it um, so this video doesn't take forever because it's a very simple routine as you guys can see um, If you take away all the talking that I've been doing for for now if, I, if you take away all the talking it's probably supposed to be like Maximum a five minute video um, So I'm just gonna fast forward it and then we are going to See my face after I have hubba blended um, the whole situation after I blend out the powder, the church was gonna be up. So let's go. Okay guys, so basically I think that I look perfectly blended. So what I just do is any excess powder I just use like my hands to take it off so I don't look like all kinds of white or patchy. So the next thing I do is to fix my brows which you guys can see is really really jacked up. So to take off all the excess powder from my brows I just like take my index finger and I dab into like a li just a little bit of cream you don't want to put too much so this kind of serves as the gel or whatever but the whole point of doing this is to actually take off the excess powder from the brow so i'm just going to do this like so 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 so, so. <laughs> i play a lot guys so um as you guys can see the black in my you know um, brows have actually come out really nicely so as you guys already know when it comes to shaping my brows if you guys scroll down on my channel you'll see that i don't use brow brush or gel and this is that's what i said you guys that's what i said you guys this is the easiest and the cheapest makeup technique slash routine of 2019 guys okay this is so cheap this is so basic nothing is extraordinarily stressful it's a very simple routine so next thing i'm going to do guys like i showed you guys in my other video excuse all the noise in the background everybody seems to be awake okay obviously i mean it's past 12 so everybody should be awake but it's saturday everybody's indoors so all the noise that people were not making during the week they just decided to make it over the weekend but 
I digress. I come back. Okay. <laughs> so back to what I was saying, guys. You scroll down my channel, you'll be able to see my makeup routine. Uh, not makeup, so my eyebrow routine. I don't use any brow gel, brow brush, anything like that. I just use a fine toothed blue comb. Okay. So let's get into this brow, shall we? Okay guys, so brows are done, all right? So this is what, that's just basically what I do to my brows. And sometimes it may take a little bit of a while to get as perfect, to get it as perfect as I want it to look. So brows are now straight to the lips. Now these are my go-to, I love. I love these two lip balms. I found them at the same store that I got this body cream, okay, that I decided to try. Now this cream smells really good guys it smells absolutely delicious um but i don't think it has any kind of effect on my skin so i'm definitely going to be changing my cream um but for now or maybe just like i might as well just like use my mom's nivea natural fairness so before you guys are like ew how can you like share a cream with somebody else ew that's how it comes out we don't dip fingers into it we squirt it out because relax okay thank you now <laughs> back to what i was saying so these are these are the two um lip balms that i use now this one i actually put on hold i started using this one this one is basically almost finished so this is one i'm going to use it will smell Woo, so good delicious yes and they, they they're literally they give like a lip gloss effect it really pops as you guys can see very soon it's basically almost finished as you guys can see I love it so I'm just gonna take my finger and I'm just going to put it in there and I am just going to pop the lips okay Okay, guys. Anyways, guys, that is that is. That's what I said. As I told you guys, it's the easiest, it's the cheapest, it's the quickest makeup technique of 2019, guys. So please tag me if you guys give this makeup um, this makeup routine a try. Let me know if you guys have, you know, like a different type uh, or a different way to achieve this achieve this look. with just like literally with my powder. I can't even find my powder guys okay so literally two products <laughs> basically or three products if you want to call it that but um if you guys you know can you know achieve this look like in a different way with a different product or whatever it is just let me know in the comment section down below and if you do um make a video that's that you know if you, if you guys want to remake this video just like comment down below for me to come check yours out so i can give it a shout out so yes guys anyways thank you so much for watching this video um i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys liked it and um this is just this is the look that i um use on hot days specifically because i know i'm going to sweat you don't want to pile on tons of makeup on your hot day because honey 
honey okay you don't want to look crazy so um this is basically what i just do to mattify my face to look presentable and look put together Please, guys thank you so much for watching this video i hope you guys like this video and please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys in my next video thank you so much for coming back um shout out to my new subscribers and i'll see you guys in my next video love you guys god bless you bye